Hello everybody, day 16. We've got two exercises only, no cardio. Press ups and crunches. We're going to do each one for 30 seconds, four times. So it's only a 10 second rest at the end. There's going to be four sets of press ups. So we'll do normal press ups at the beginning. And then Aaron's going to give us three little varieties of press ups to do. Just quick 10 seconds on press ups. Remember, your head. Different versions of press ups. So you've got to start off <clears throat> in your box position. This is the easiest version to do. Okay, even if your knees are a little bit further in, make sure your elbows are going back at an angle, capital letter A, and your head is in front of your hands. You can also take one leg off, upper body doesn't stay exactly the same. Okay, or two knees off, you can do your full ones. Again, from the waist up, nothing changes. Okay, the only thing that changes is the knees. I'm going to be very brave and try and do full press ups with my knees off the floor. It might not last all four sets, but we'll give it a go. So I'm standard to press up first. 30 seconds only. Yeah. Nice and slow. Let's go. So in 30 seconds of press ups, you should really only be getting maybe about 12, 15 reps tops. If you're lowering for one to two seconds, one second up, and then you're just going to be getting your about 10 to 12 reps roughly. So if, if, the reason oh. I say that is if you're trying to get 18 to 20 out, you're probably going too quick and your technique's poor. So keep your head in front of your hands, oh. elbows going back, capital letter A. Try and imagine the following that line. Roll over onto your back, crunches. <coughs> so here we're going to do two crunches, two obliques. That's it. So we're reaching across. So two up, we'll then reach across. Right hand across the left knee, left hand across the right knee, and then back into your two. Just going to keep repeating that for 30 seconds. So two and two. So again, in 30 seconds, you don't want to rush. We're not trying to do hundreds and hundreds of uh, abs. Your core isn't just your six pack, so when we're reaching across, we're bringing in other muscles, same when you're doing your press ups. Got another five or six seconds here. So we'll probably get another one of those, another full set of the two and two in. And a little bit of rest. Good. So this time, when you do a press up, you're going to release one leg off the floor. So you can do these on your knees as well. Watch. So you're going to bring one leg up. As you press down, one foot comes up. Okay. Even if you're on your knees, you can still release one leg. All right. So we're going to do this for 30 seconds. Alternate the legs as you go. Press up position. Let's go again. So I oh. find this gets a little bit tougher. If you've been doing your full ones, just adds a little bit more. Stay in control. Oh. Breathe in at the top. Keep that core nice and tight. So even though you're not directly working your abs, being in that position, you are working a lot of your core muscles. 30 odd muscles make up your core, not just your six packs. So you oh. work all of it. This is horrible. And crunches. Good. Roll back over. Front so I, position. I did it last way, with the knees. Before, <laughs> it's tough, those ones. So two and two. So the crunches will always stay the same. Okay, so do your two normal crunches, two across. So you've got to get your shoulder blades off the floor. That's the important thing. Breathe in at the bottom, breathe out when you squeeze up. So you're really trying to suck your belly button in. Couple more seconds. Oh, sorry, a couple more reps, about five or six seconds. Good, just rest. Press up position. This time we're going to do a shoulder tap. So you're going to do a full press up. Right hand to tap your left shoulder. Left hand to tap your right shoulder. Have a quick look. So press. Don't go too quick with the taps. Okay. So you don't want to just you don't want to throw your hand up and smack your chest. Oh, let us. You want to be in control. Let's go now. Okay. So press. Start with the hardest. Bring your right hand across. Just touch your shoulder and then go back down again into the key <sighs> position. So you might have to just shift your weight slightly across. You don't want to turn and spin around. Come on! Nice, big, strong press up. Come on, Deadman! Press that arm, just tap it gently. Just tap it gently, don't go quick. Okay, you want to be in control of that body. Get your chest to the floor, get that range. Chest all the way down, roll over, crunch. Oh, I'm so relieved to hear you say that. <laughs> Let's go, two on two. Tuck your belly button in. Breathe out as you squeeze up. Two normal, two oblique crunches. Reaching across. The outside of your hand is going just past the line of your knee. Okay, so try and get that arm right up. Good. 
range of movement. We need to get that full range by shoulder blades going all the way down and then squeezing them up. Go stay to my face, it's pouring <laughs> sweat. Uh, Good, and rest. Oh, Last yeah. one, this time I'm going to do a press up flag. So I'm going to do a press up, and you're going to open that body right up and then back round again. That's what he thinks. So we'll show you the flag quickly. Will so, we? Yeah, we've got, we've got these. So press up, all the way down. As you come up, you're going to open the body right up and then back into another press up. And these can be done in the full position as well. Or you might want to be able to do your press up on your knees, but you might be able to do the full flag. Okay, so you might want to do a press up on your knees and then take them off the floor to do your flags. Let's okay. go. You're already starting. You're already I have. You see how <laughs> I've got my feet quite wide? That's slightly cheating possibly, isn't it? It just gives you a, a, a more solid base. If your core, say if your core's tired or quite weak at this point, you might find opening your feet helps you. If you can put <sighs> your feet together, then you can try it. You'll find that the flag becomes a lot harder. <sighs> So you might want to now drop down, and as Annie's doing now, just drop it down to her knees. You still might be able to do the flag in the full position as you bring your knees up. A fat chance of that. <laughs> and straight into crunches. Good one, well done. Roll over. Two crunches, two obliques. Last little set and then we're done. So it's been a nice strength here, so we've, in every listen to him, Just listen to him burbling off. It's been a nice little set. It's been a nice little set. The press ups and the crunches, you're working a lot of your core muscles there. Which is super important. Ten more seconds. Two and two, reach across. Okay, I'm done. Okay, I'm done. And rest. Well done. You are beautiful. Easy day. I hope you'll poop like me. <laughs> See you tomorrow. For what's it going to be? It's going to be day. 17. 17. I can't read because I'm blind. <laughs> See you tomorrow.